We have seven returners and seven newcomers to the team. Definitely looking forward to getting started and seeing what we can do and hopefully surprise some, pe some people. Team captains this year are Jillian Foster and Emily Heimbecker. Jillian will be playing our libero position this year with her leadership skills. She can definitely get us to where we need to be defensively. We've been gelling on and off the court. We've improved in our communication. Um, just a whole aspect of the game. I think there's a lot of drive and want to win. Emily Heimbecker is our sophomore captain this year, so she'll be a very good impact player on our outside, providing a lot of offense for us. I think since I'm young, I can really relate to the freshmen. I can understand their needs and help them to really become part of our team. My overall goal is that we always play like a team. There's just that want to either put the ball down or keep the ball up for the longest amount of time. We are expecting to maintain the level that we were at last year. We did increase the strength of our schedule, um, so we'll see how that progresses. We are looking for a 20-win season at least. We've got our middle hitter, Paige Horrigan. Um, she's going to be a senior this year. She's one of the best blockers in the Freedom Conference. We're really looking for her to lead us offensively. We also have our libero, Eden Reichard. She may be playing a little bit of a different role this year, depending on what we concentrate on, um, but she was uh, an incredible libero last year. We've been working on her moving back to a hitting position, so we could either see her as an outside hitter or as a libero. Another top returner for us is Amanda Wallet. She just played defense last year. We may be seeing her wear the libero jersey this year now that she's fully healed from her knee injury. Our only graduate from last year was on the outside hitting position, so we are looking at a freshman outside hitter, Kate Anderson. Our setter, Brooke Horrigan, is gonna be a sophomore. She was our backup setter last year. Uh, we're looking for her to take the reins and really lead us this year. Our setter, Justine McNulty, is going to be a senior this year and suffered a car accident about three weeks before preseason started. Um, she needs to take some time off right now, and uh, we don't know if she'll be back for the season yet or not, so Brooke is really taking the reins.